the Irish elk, a creature of myth and legend. Known to science as Megaloceros giganteus, it was the largest deer to ever walk the earth. Imagine a creature so grand, so imposing that it dwarfed even the largest moose of today, standing up to 7 feet tall at the shoulders, with antlers spanning up to 12 feet across, the Irish elk was a true giant of the animal kingdom, this was the Irish elk, roaming the vast grasslands and open woodlands of Europe and Asia, it was a dominant presence in its ecosystem, but the Irish elk was more than just its size, its magnificent antlers which could weigh up to 90 pounds, were not just for show, they played a crucial role in mating displays and battles for dominance, it was a testament to the power of nature, a symbol of the wild beauty that once graced our planet. The Irish elk thrived during the last ice age, adapting to the changing climates and landscapes. And yet, it is gone. As the ice age ended and the climate warmed, the lush grasslands began to shrink. The Irish elk struggled to find enough food to sustain its massive size, lost to the mists of time. By around 7,700 years ago, the last of these majestic creatures had vanished. Its story is a reminder of the fragility of life, of the delicate balance that sustains all creatures, including ourselves. The extinction of the Irish elk serves as a poignant lesson in the importance of preserving our natural world. It is a story that we must never forget, a story that urges us to protect the wonders of nature, so that future generations can marvel at the beauty and diversity of life on Earth. The Irish elk thrived during the late Pleistocene epoch, a time when the earth was teeming with life and the landscapes were vastly different from what we see today. This was a time of great upheaval and change, where the forces of nature were constantly reshaping the world. It was an era marked by ice ages and warming periods, cycles of freezing and thawing that created a dynamic and often harsh environment. The Irish elk roamed the earth alongside woolly mammoths, saber-toothed cats, and other iconic creatures of the last ice age, forming a vibrant and diverse ecosystem. But around 7,700 years ago, the Irish elk vanished, leaving behind only bones and fossils as a testament to its existence. Its reign, once so powerful and majestic, came to an abrupt and mysterious end, shrouded in the mists of time. The reasons for its extinction are complex and still debated by scientists, involving a combination of environmental changes and possibly human activities. What we do know is that the world was changing rapidly, the climate was shifting, and with it, the ecosystems that the Irish elk depended on were transforming. The familiar landscapes that the Irish elk knew were disappearing, replaced by new environments that were less hospitable to these giant deer. These changes, combined with other pressures such as competition for resources and possibly hunting by early humans, proved too much for the giant deer to overcome. The story of the Irish elk is a poignant reminder of the fragility of life and the ever-changing nature of our planet. The Irish elk was a creature of immense size and grandeur. Standing up to seven feet tall at the shoulder, it towered over humans, but its most striking feature, the one that truly set it apart, was its antlers. Imagine antlers spanning nearly 12 feet from tip to tip. These were not simply weapons, they were works of art. Each antler was a testament to the power and majesty of the Irish elk, a symbol of its dominance over the landscape. These magnificent structures were likely used for display, to attract mates and intimidate rivals. They were a symbol of strength and virility, a testament to the evolutionary forces that shaped this remarkable creature. The Irish elk was a creature of the open landscapes. Its fossils have been found across Europe, Asia, and North Africa, indicating a wide range and adaptability. It roamed the vast plains and grasslands, its massive antlers held high. From the rolling hills of Ireland to the steppes of Siberia, the Irish elk was a familiar sight. It was a part of the fabric of these ancient ecosystems, playing a vital role in the balance of nature. Its presence would have shaped the landscape, influencing the growth of vegetation and the behavior of other animals. The Irish elk was a keystone species, its fate intertwined with the fate of countless others. Section 5 A Gentle Giant's Diet Despite its imposing size, the Irish elk was a herbivore. It grazed on grasses, shrubs, and other vegetation, its large size allowing it to reach foliage that was inaccessible to smaller animals. Imagine this gentle giant moving across the landscape, 
its massive antlers swaying as it browsed for food. It was a peaceful creature, its days spent in search of sustenance. Its diet was dictated by the seasons, with the Irish elk migrating to find the best grazing grounds. During the harsh winter months it would have relied on stored fat reserves and whatever meager vegetation it could find beneath the snow. Section 6. Built for Survival. The Irish elk was well suited to its environment, its long legs allowed it to run swiftly across the open plains, escaping predators or pursuing mates. Its hooves were broad and sturdy, providing stability on uneven terrain. Its senses were keen, allowing it to detect danger from afar. Its large size alone would have been enough to deter many predators, but the Irish elk was also capable of defending itself with its massive antlers. In the face of danger, the Irish elk could charge with surprising speed its antlers lowered like a battering ram. It was a force to be reckoned with, a testament to the power of natural selection. Section 7. The Shadow of Extinction. But even the most well-adapted creatures are not immune to the forces of change. The world that the Irish elk knew was coming to an end, and with it, the reign of the giant deer. The exact causes of the Irish elk's extinction are still a matter of debate. However, it is likely that a combination of factors, including climate change and human activity, contributed to its demise. The world was changing, and the Irish elk, for all its strength and majesty, was unable to adapt quickly enough. Its story is a reminder that even the mightiest of creatures are vulnerable to the forces of nature. Section 8. Climate's Unforgiving Hand As the last ice age came to an end the climate began to warm. This warming marked a significant shift in the Earth's environmental conditions, leading to dramatic changes in various ecosystems. Glaciers retreated, sea levels rose, and forests spread across the land. These transformations were not just gradual but also relentless, reshaping the very fabric of the natural world. These changes had a profound impact on the Irish elk's habitat. The vast open grasslands which were once abundant and provided ample food and shelter, began to diminish. The open grasslands that the Irish elk depended on for food and shelter, were shrinking. As forests encroached upon these grasslands, the Irish elk found it increasingly difficult to find the resources they needed to survive. Forests, while providing habitat for other animals, offered little sustenance for the giant deer. The dense canopy and thick underbrush of the forest were not suitable for the Irish elk's grazing habits. Food became scarce, and competition for resources increased. The Irish elk had to compete with other species for the limited food available, leading to further stress on their population. The changing climate also affected the Irish elk's breeding cycles. Warmer temperatures and altered seasonal patterns disrupted their natural rhythms, making it harder for them to reproduce successfully. Warmer temperatures disrupted the timing of plant growth, which in turn affected the availability of food during crucial times of the year, such as the breeding season. This disruption meant that the Irish elk often faced food shortages when they needed it the most, further threatening their survival. Section 9. The Hunter's Toll. The arrival of humans in Europe also played a role in the Irish elk's demise. As human populations grew, they began to encroach upon the Irish elk's territory, competing for resources and hunting the giant deer for its meat and antlers. While it is unlikely that hunting alone drove the Irish elk to extinction, it certainly put additional pressure on an already struggling population. The combination of habitat loss, climate change and human activity proved too much for the Irish elk to overcome. Section 10. A Legacy in Bone. Today all that remains of the Irish elk are its bones. Fossils of this magnificent creature have been found in bogs, caves, and other locations across its former range. These remains provide a tantalizing glimpse into the past, allowing us to reconstruct the Irish elk's appearance, behavior, and ultimate fate. Museums around the world display the skeletal remains of Irish elk, their massive antlers a testament to their former glory. These exhibits serve as a reminder of the incredible biodiversity that once existed on our planet and the importance of conservation efforts to protect the species that remain. Section 11. A World Without Giants. The extinction of the Irish elk marked the loss of a truly remarkable creature. It was a symbol of the wild beauty and grandeur of the natural world, a testament to the power of evolution. Its story is a reminder of the interconnectedness of all living things, and the importance of protecting our planet's biodiversity. In a world without Irish elk, we are left to wonder what other magnificent creatures have vanished from the Earth. 
their stories lost to the mists of time. It is our responsibility to learn from the past and to ensure that the remaining giants of the natural world do not suffer the same fate.